other surveys. At first, it was uh, take the survey, you get three free bagels. That happened for like over a year. Then they realized how much they're losing money. <laughs> so I think they went down to two bagels and then one. I'm like, three free bagels? No cream cheese, but still. Three free bagels. And we did donate the bagels at the like a food bank or, uh, or I would take it to a facility. But still living out that time, you know, because COVID and stuff. I don't know. I don't know about you, but I like free food. I have no idea where the library is. Do you know where the library is? Okay. I, maybe she knows by some kind of second sight or okay. something. This is all dorm room, I'm, sh I'm sure of that. Mm. Maybe there's an information page or something like that. This is the Waits residence hall right here. You can kind of see it. There. Okay, awesome. Well, thank you so Waits much. residence hall for Chibu. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you for your little time. Little semester Sorry two. about the little distraction at the beginning. I can hear the bell going right there. I don't know. There is information. There's going to be information centers that are uh, that are around. Uh oh, we gotta have to get head out. What's going on? Don't say anything private, but what's going on? Like general, general stuff. Interview, interview. Okay, interviews general. Down. Okay. Uh, do you want it? Do you want to like stink by the library? I bet this guy over here knows. Okay, we'll ask him. Ask him real quick. Stink by. Hello. Hi. Hello, I need you. Okay. How did she know that? Hi, sir. Hi. Uh, you know where the library is located? Like the TCU library? In the front? Yeah. Okay. Like right here? No, no, no. no. On the other side of University. Gotcha. Yep. I know where it's at. I've been there. I've been there. I know. I remember now. Thank you. Yep. I remember. It's on the other side in the front. Actually, where we're going anyway. Now, I must have taken the largest steps in the world because every time I'm doing this kind of stuff, I'm way far ahead. I don't know why. Yeah, it's it's on the other side of university, so we're pretty far from the library right now. I'll give you like sneak shots, over the shoulder shots of where we're at in the middle of TCU. Okay, there's gonna be a lot of stop and starts with her. Here's one lawn right here. So this lawn on the other side of the university is where the library is located. You about ready? Okay. So it'll be some time before we get there. He's got another message. So it's like, stop and start, stop and start, stop and start. You can take that staircase. Yep. Yep, you missed it. All right. This one's uh, just as good, though. Not for skaters, though. You can tell right here. Not for skateboarding. All right, are you about ready, sweetie? I guess I'm ready. Just okay. One moment. One moment. We're just going to, like, peek inside the library just for a second. Okay. One you got some messages? Okay. Beautiful tree right here. I like touching trees. Feel the different texture of the tree. You can hear the cicadas. Some call them um, crickets. Some call them uh, locusts. It's more like a locust 
and a cicada. Um, you probably want to walk this way and do it. You should be able to catch your, uh, your cellular should kick in. You got 5G, I actually have LTE. You about ready? Yes, yes, one moment, one moment, please. Okay. I can't remember the name of the place where I'm going to interview it. It's not on Indeed. It's not on Indeed? No. I still have no idea. Okay. Well, we're halfway there and we're running out of time. Okay, hold on. So... These are cool too, right here. Like a bird pooped right there. All right, about ready? Okay. Okay. We're getting there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cross university right in the center of TCU. Whoa, <laughs> that was a loud noise. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in the middle of TCU and cross university right off the uh, crosswalk, the middle of town. Usually around like lunchtime, it gets real busy. I mean, like really busy. Uh, and people will cross that crosswalk in hundreds. I've always wanted to be like the first car to stop at it. So I could turn the recorder on it a couple times. Very difficult to do to get the timing right. Boy, it's a hot one. What do you think the temperature is? About 100? About 100 degrees? Yeah, it's usually when I'm out filming, about 100 degrees. Beautiful campus though, absolutely gorgeous. We might could swing by, this side here is a central campus. That's Foster Hall right here. Foster Hall right there. And then we're gonna pass right on the back side of Jarvis Hall. Um, then we're gonna swing around be the front of campus. Oh, we got uh, TCU uh, horned frogs, like horn, like a horn frog. There, kind of see them. And we got another horn frog. You can see. Maybe Linda will will kind of do a demonstration and sit on this bench that looks like a horn frog. It's actually a frog. You want to sit on it, sweetie? Oh, yes, yes, real quick. It's a horn frog. Real quick. Yeah. So this is a horn frog bench right here. Kind of see it. There's the actual horns. You see the horn there. There's Linda and I. Hi. All right, let's go. We'll be back. We'll be back. We're going. No, don't come here. Okay. Oh, we got to have a conversation. Yes. Okay, that's conversation. where I have to cut off. Okay. 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 Like. Okay. We, so we what we want to do that. is we want to go right by the front of the library. We got 12 minutes. We'll go right by the very front, and then we'll just head over to the parking place. You got 15 minutes to get to the interview. Yeah, we'll get there if they're town. That's fine. We have time. Okay, all right. All right. Sorry. No problem. I had to talk to you. Sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. I, I'm interrupting. No problem. All right. So we're going to cross the central side. Well, center of campus is really where we're going to be. We're going to cross right over right in front of the library. She wants to see the library. She likes libraries. Yes. Okay. And then we got pretty trees right here. Beautiful trees. So you said literally you just parked right over here? Uh-huh. Well, I'm I'm over that way, right? Right over that way. Yep. This is the center of, of it right over here. Wouldn't this be great to do a vampire movie? I just think, of, you know, because I auditioned for a vampire movie here. I didn't get it. I was, I'm still upset about it. But it was maybe like 20 years ago. Maybe more than that. Let's see, what am I? Oh, 50? Oh, wow. That was more than that. It was like 25 years ago. When I auditioned for that vampire movie. I don't even know if they did the movie. Okay. Vampires can walk out in the sun. So that's actually, you know, legit. If you're a vampire, you can be under the sun. Uh, according to us. Uh, is Stephanie Myers? Stephanie Myers. All right. Dave Cree Hall. It's right here. We're going to look at it this way. Back over that way. And this is for liberal arts. So if you're a Republican, stay out of that building. Uh, or conservative. You want to stay far from that building. That's the building where they go up to and they make the cross sign. Hey, make a cross sign with your hand. Cross sign. Do it again one more time. Okay. Um, then we've got uh, 
Or that's not what I meant by a cross. You were making an X. It would have worked if she made a cross. You make a cross, not an X. Like a crucifixion cross. Right here, right here. Okay. okay. Let's give it this way. And then we'll cross the main strip right here. This is an interesting bench right here. I'm gonna see how when you sit on it, it's got these little bumps right here. It's very cool, probably for the rain. I got this belt issue going on right here. There we go. Okay, about ready? Do my own little vampire movie. Oh, see what I mean? Right here. There's all the fresh blood right over this way crossing. That's the road I was talking about. Little. Tons of them. All right, we're gonna cross this way right by the library. And then uh, the library. Gonna cross to the library. Go this way, over. come on. Crossing this way. Uh, you wanna hold one hand up just like this. Just like that, and you're walking through. Do the crossing guard move, there we go. All right, then we're gonna pass right here. That's the library, or one of them, Mary Ka Coots Burnett Library. Burnett is such a popular name in Fort Worth, if you know anything about Fort Worth. I wrote a character in the Thief story. It's uh, told in three different separate parts of three different characters. And Tom Burnett is the art thief. And it, he's one of the big characters. If you read it, if you go in my description and look under uh, Fiction Press, you'll find the story Thief story. It's one of the novels I wrote. This is actually Mary Coutts Burnett Library. So this is the library you're talking about? Yes. Okay. Maybe you go in. Yeah, we can go in real quick. Do you want to get this? Yeah, we'll get, we'll get it. Cool. Just running out of time there. There's the steps I climbed up. And this says, Ipsa Sainshinta. Paul Testa Esta. I mispronounced that. All right, here we go. Remember, tobacco free. So don't go in there smoking a pipe. Okay. This is the library. Oh, cool. I don't think we can get in, so we, but we can at least sneak in. Do you need a card to get in? You need a card? Oh, you just walk in? Okay, cool. Okay. Exactly like Walmart, only it's a library. Boy, you get some rare books in this one, I'll tell you that. Look at this one right up here. All these people.
Okay, now we can talk. Okay, so that was a TCU library that we went through right there. We did a little pass. I had to put you in my pocket a couple of times because certain people were like going. Yeah, uh, anyway. Okay. It's a pretty cool campus. I mean, I don't see why a great filmmaker has not come from this campus. Actually, I came from Texas Wesleyan. I didn't go to TCU. I wasn't, I didn't have enough money, but I've been on campus a few times. But I went to Texas Wesleyan, and then I went to UNT, and then I went to the New School University in New York. I know, we got, we got a little bit of time, a little bit of time. You always wanna stay in the shot when you can, especially if you're an actor. If you're not an actor, then don't worry about it, but if you're an actor, you wanna get into the shot somehow. Do something like that. I think this might be a dead end right here. That's okay, let's, we'll go down this way. It's fine, we'll find it, we'll come on, let's go, we got it. We'll figure it out. We're on a time crunch. Oh. Nope, it's not. There's a staircase over that way. This is what it's like hanging out with me. I've gone through a couple of marriages. Let's just put it that way. Especially, she used to be in Washington, D.C. I stuck out like a... Washington, D.C., I stuck out like a sore thumb. Ooh, this is for skateboarding. If you're a skateboarder, come here now. This would work. It's called a rail slide right there. Perfect for skateboarders. These would work over here too. I find skateboarding spots too. It's one, one thing I do on, on the show. So there are a couple of them for the TCU area. We did find it. The other ones are right here. Big time skateboarding. So you could probably get a couple uh, photos for Thrasher Magazine right here. This is a cool magazine. There's like all these skateboarders, but it's a sellout magazine. It is Thrasher Sellout. It is. I've never been in it, but. It's a pretty cool magazine. And uh, you can get really good going right here. Get a couple of good skateboard moves right there. Also for parking. Parking's like a big issue. If you ever see my actor, if I'm directing, because I direct, if my actor looks kind of like serious and stuff, it's because we've been out too long and you know, the meter's running. You're know, like, God, those actors look so serious. That's because they got to make it back to the parking meter. All right, that was a pass. Right off of Bowie. Or Linda would say Bowie. Or I'd say Bowie. She'd say Bowie. Uh, yeah, I would say Bowie. West Bowie. This is West Bowie right here. We're crossing West Bowie. All right, let's go. Come on. I didn't see the truck. Sorry about that. Hey, come on, let's go. New York City. We'd be we'd be on fire. Bam. One trip to the New York City is all we need. Boom. Millions of subscribers. We'd get the ticket. I'll talk to my mom. We might do it. All we need is about a thousand dollars to cover that month, and we'd be good. One thousand. You can you can you can actually fund the channel by going to my PayPal. It's paypal.me slash Spivey. And we'll use that thousand to get to New York City and vlog the Statue of Liberty uh, Memorial or the World Trade Center Memorial. Um, everything, you know, uh, the library there, Broadway, uh, the village, Soho, um, CBGB's old spot, all the cool stuff. I've been to CBGB. I was there originally before it, before they tore it down or made it into a gift store across this way. I got, that was that, that was a timer going off so we got it i i always don't forget the timer the timer always goes off so i cut in right there at the last minute of the timer so i almost had a pretty long shot there i'm dealing with a lot of technical a lot of technical at one time all right let me open this door for linda and then we got to head to another interview all right Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
All right, so we're gonna be headed uh, another area and we'll get back with you. Okay, I'm turn it and we did all that in 99 degrees Fahrenheit. 99 degrees Fahrenheit. Gonna be Linda's drink, her ghetto drink that she'll sell. It's called strawberry juice. Might not be called grape juice. Because <laughs> I'm about this. <laughs> and Red Bull. This stuff gives you wings. It does pep you up though, Red Bull does. She just froze in time and space. There we go. And that was TCU. And you're all the way from California. known as in drive it's a right chair app That said John Smith subs. I think he said something about parking. Did he say something about free parking? called Harper right there. Oh. El Mato. Oh, it's right there. Um, it's 700 that way. Alright, so this is Fort Worth. And I know a good place to park. I don't know if I'm going to share my secret, but uh, probably won't. Because if I tell you where to park, then everybody else will park there too. But I know I know a free parking area. It's very uh, kind of secretive, so I'm not gonna tell you about it. But I will kind of hint it. I'll hint it if you come to Fort Worth. There is free parking now. There is at Sundance Square, but it's only certain hours. So Sundance Square, which is over this way, which is not where I'm going, but that is free parking uh, on the weekends certain hours this is jubilee right here it's a jubilee it's a black theater they do really great theater there 
It's an African uh, theater. And there's Circle Theater right there. That's the other theater right next to Jubilee, not too far. I had a telemarketer call me. I told them if they call me again, I'm going to sue them. That's why I interrupted the shot. And this is uh, the new... Uh, it used to be uh, Bank One. This was actually Bank One, the Bank One building. Tornado hit it. This is back in the mid-90s or early 90s. I think it was like mid-90s, 90-ish, between 90 and 99. It hit it sometime, and uh, it was a tornado, and they turned this in the mid-90s into skyscraper condos, and I've been up there. It's really nice. It's called the Tower, so they changed it from the Bank One to the Tower. It's now called the Tower, and it's a really nice uh, place, too. They also have a club in the basement, and right down the road from here is a place called Scats. It's one of the best jazz clubs in the nation. It's actually true. It's a great jazz club. It's called Scats. But this right here in the basement is a club. It's really cool. They do have restaurant space for lease too. If you like to bring in like a good gourmet Mexican food place, that's really good. And that's Chop House, Mercury Chop House right there. We're headed to another area. So bad news or sad news is that they closed down the library. So unfortunately, a great thing that they had was the downtown library. Now, I don't know if this is completely true. It could be rumor. But what I heard in an article is that they're actually closing the Fort Worth library. And I, I don't know why they would do such a thing, but that's what I heard. They're gonna close the library. Yep. It says it right here. This location is permanently closed. For more locations, visit, and it has information for other locations. Don't know why, but they're closing that entire library. Here's the old sign for it right here. The Fort Worth Public Library Foundation. This is where I found out about the Actor Studio too, was from this library. I got a book on the Actor uh, Studio and uh, method acting. It's called Method Actors is the book. It's got Dustin Hoffman and Marlon Brando, Jack Nicholson on the cover. It's got all these actors, headshots on the cover. I learned about that from this library and they're closing it down. It's a sad world, but no need for the library. So just keep downtown Fort Worth library free, I guess. But they do have a college right over there, which has a library called TCC. They have a library there that you can go into. Don't know why they would do that, but they have the reasons. Mexico. window for copyright copyright doesn't seep into the show you kind of hear it over here it's funny you know, copyright seeps in all of a sudden content you know gets blocked we got to keep the copyright out or what copyright that you can keep out you know that's one that's the only thing we fight against really as youtubers that's about it it's just copyright uh other than that you know life is fun at least there's a famous song playing there's razoo's right there and there is the downtown square right here. And to the left of that is the courtyard. Yep. Uh, court, uh, 
the house, sorry, courthouse. There's the flying uh, saucer right here, flying saucer. Established in 1995 when I was in college. Still there today. I'm passing AMC Palace. This is where I saw Mystic River. Also saw Truman Show at that palace right there. Truman Show, Mystic River. Um, what else did I see there? I'm trying to remember all the movies I've seen there. Oh, I saw Snake Eyes there. Brian De Palma's Snake Eyes. And if I'm not mistaken, Victoria and I saw uh, Summer of Sam by Spike Lee. We saw that there at AMC Palace. Yep, at that AMC Palace. I saw um, Summer of Sam, Mystic River, Truman Show. It's, it's a cool palace. It's a cool uh, AMC Palace. Spider-Man's playing there now. Oppenheimer, Chris Nolan's Oppenheimer. Barbie with uh, Ryan Gosling. And right here is Sundance Square. Calhoun Street. Calhoun. It's kind of one of those road, uh, Calhoun is kind of one of those words that you would go, Calhoun. Cheesecake Factory's right here. Lynn and I got kicked out of that. Out of this cheesecake factory, they asked us to leave right there. They're like, can y'all please leave? And we left. I think that manager was fired. I think it was from Mexico. Right over this way is Bass Hall right here. That's major Bass Hall. It's the funniest musical of all time. Frozen's coming there. So they're bringing in Frozen. Oh, cool. They're working on something right here. Calhoun! We're on Calhoun! We are, we're on Calhoun. We're gonna cross uh, 6th Street. Sometimes I, I talk and it comes out like I'm from the north. So I said cross rather than cross. Cause I used to live in New York. So sometimes it sounds like I'm talking from like the Yankee style talk. I try, I try to make everything like just one dialect. So that it sounds, you know, like I'm from one region, but sometimes it comes out and I say crass because I lived in New York for a while. It, it seeps in you, you know, dialects seep in you, but really I'm born and raised in Fort Worth. So it should be mostly kind of a Southern style accent. But if it ever comes off Northern, I'm sorry. I've lived in other places. I lived in California. I lived in Maine, the state of Maine for about 17 months. I lived in New York for about a year. I lived in Long Beach, California for about a year. And uh, mostly here. M most all my life I've been in Fort Worth. But I have lived outside. I've lived in Carrollton, uh, Texas. I've lived in Irving for about four years. So they talk a little bit different Irving because everybody's from uh, India. Bunch of Hindi there. If you live in Irving, you're actually a minority if you're white. There's, it's mostly Hindi. So it's, it's the population. There's more temples there than churches. More Hindi temples than churches. But they're just hard to find. The, te the temple, the Hindi temples are very difficult to find. Because they keep on shopping centers. They don't really look like temples. It's actually true. And they have a bunch of Hindi restaurants there as well. It's a cool place, Irving. You want Hindi food, you go there. Calhoun! There is a train station. Yeah, we shot a film here once in a lifetime. It was actually on this street right here. Rob Vasquez walks right across this road right here. 
and then turns to the left. He's playing a character called Pastor Rec. And then we did some of it in the water pit. Right over that way. And that's pretty much Fort Worth in a nutshell. And there's a memorial for John F. Kennedy, because he did come through Fort Worth before he was assassinated on 11 21, uh, 1963. He was assassinated on 11 22, 1963, the next day in Dallas. But he was here in Fort Worth on 11 21, 1963. And then the next day on 11 22, 1963, he was assassinated in Dallas. But he was here in Fort Worth the day before. And that's John F. Kennedy. We'll look at that in a minute. Oh, I see. I see it now. There it goes. Giving back to society. Go ahead and set my timer. 